In today's cartoon story joke, we deal with the realm of manners, where Renaissance elegance meets modern wit. There's a classroom scene that's pure comedy gold. Picture this, Michael's blunt restroom request, Sherman's suave exit, and Johnny's charming flourish. It's a hilarious journey through the corridors of etiquette where even a simple bathroom break becomes a lesson in finesse. Ah, the Renaissance. When Michelangelo sculpted, Galileo pondered the stars, and Shakespeare spun tales. But amidst the cultural explosion, manners had their moment in the spotlight. Enter Giovanni della Casa, the Renaissance's Miss Manners, preaching the gospel of etiquette in his 1558 masterpiece, Galateo. His advice? No public hair combing or hand washing, unless it's before dinner, where cleanliness is next to godliness, especially when your hands double as utensils. But forks? Oh, they were scandalous. Initially seen as too fancy or too girly for the gents, they were a slow burn to popularity. Meanwhile, communal spoons ruled the soup scene, where Erasmus sagely advised to wipe before you re-dip. And let's not forget the elephant in the room, or rather the dinner table, farting. Erasmus had a solution. If you can't escape, let a cough mask the sound. Smooth, right? But today's misconduct says to spare your dinner companions the symphony of smells. But fear not, not all Renaissance etiquette is ancient history. Giovanni della Casa warned against nosy wine sniffing and sharing half-eaten fare, a lesson lost on poor George Costanza. Remember the double dipping drama? Renaissance folks were way ahead of the curve, keeping their manners as clean as their soup spoons. Ah, progress. Gather around, folks. It's time to kick off a rollicking joke. And today's hero once again is the evergreen little Johnny. During one of her daily classes, a teacher attempted to install some etiquette into her students. She posed the question, Michael, imagine you're out for dinner with a charming young lady. How would you politely excuse yourself to use the facilities? Michael, without missing a beat, replied, hang on, I've got to hit the restroom really quick. The teacher raised an eyebrow, unimpressed. A bit too direct, Michael. Let's try for a touch more finesse. Sherman, your turn. How would you handle it? Sherman, aiming for sophistication, offered, My apologies, but I need to step away for a moment. I'll return promptly. Closer, the teacher nodded approvingly, but still room for improvement. Now, little Johnny, can you summon your manners and show us how it's done? How would you navigate this delicate situation? Johnny, always quick on the uptake, responded, Darling, May I beg your pardon for just a moment? I need to extend my regards to a dear friend of mine whom I'm eager to introduce to you. After our splendid dinner. <laughs> if you liked our joke, then please watch our next joke by clicking here. <laughs>